Hey guys, welcome back to Bartlett Arborist Supply. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the CMI rope jack. Before we get started, don't forget to hit that like button, uh, subscribe down to the channel, check out the rest of our con content, and drop a couple comments down at the end of the video, down below. Let us know what you think, what you want to see later on in the future, and we will try and provide that for you. So like I said, we're going to talk about the CMI rope jack. It is a mechanical advantage piece of kit for your rigging systems, setups, system, however you say it however you like to say it. Uh, it's a three to one. Uh, you don't need any pulleys, any prussics, nothing like that. It already comes all right here integrated. It is used to remove any slack or stretch. So in other words, you're pre-tensioning your system um, if you need to get, that, get rid of that stretch and you don't want it in there. Or it can also be used for tip tying just getting that leverage, lifting up a piece, but it is for light tip ties, not anything crazy heavy. Um, it's not recommended to pick heavy, heavy loads up. Uh, so, uh, so the CMI rope jack has cams where you can leave it in an open position. So when you go to install, it's already ready for you. And down here at the bottom is your carabiner slot. I like to use a steel carabiner to connect it to my porter wrap. So we would take steel carabiner boom locked in now it's already it's pretty simple and easy to on and off the rope and we will show you exactly how to do that and we'll actually have a limb that we've got rigged out uh, balance tied up and we're just going to show you how to get that mechanical advantage and how easy it is to use so i like to start by opening up my carabiner installing and i've already got my porter at pre pre-tensioned a little bit so we're gonna start with the bottom, hit that, hit that lock so it's in place. Now we got the top. Now it's in place. So here what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this, uh, unlock my porter wrap. I can let go of the rope jack because it's gonna stay in place. So I start taking off my wraps. Boom, boom. And I'm just gonna add a little bit of pretension myself by my hand. And now what I'm gonna start doing is just start to crank. So as I start to crank, I'm pulling my rope slightly and just keep doing it that way. So boom. Keep going. And as you can see behind me, that limb is starting to lift. And I can let go and progress capture. And this can be done just with one person on the ground. But if you had an extra hand, it might be a little bit easier. So someone's over here and you're concentrated on the rope jack and lifting up the load. Now, the piece is done. I don't need to lift anymore. Now I'm just going to capture my rope again. Or capture the load with my porter wrap. Sorry about that. We're going to lock that off. A couple half hitches. Now getting it off the rope may take a little bit of practice. But one of the things I like to do first is I pull down to introduce a little bit of slack here. And it allows me to open. Now the second one should already have enough slack. To where it opens up and you're able oh that over that closed on me but still easy to open up boom off the rope lock it so now it doesn't go anywhere takes off and you've got it off the rope just make sure that that cam on the bottom doesn't close back up on you but fairly easy to get off fairly easy to get on incredible mechanical advantage three to one system um, CMI also did their testing, so it shows that they can that one person actually generated about 300 to 800 pounds with uh, a force, which is pretty incredible. Um, but this has been the CMI Rope Jack. Let us know what you think. Visit us at bartlettman.com, or you can Google us just by simply searching Bartlett Arborist Supply. Thanks for watching.